I'm Vasco and today I'll show you how I'm playing You're My Best Friend by Queen. We'll do it in the original key on a high G string ukulele. So grab yours and let's go. So the weirdest thing about this song is that the parts have really strange measures it's not to eight sometimes it's to seven sometimes it is to six i'll try to explain it and write it right here so you can memorize it so let's see the parts one by one uh, we start with the intro which uh, starts with c i'm grabbing the c chord and i'm playing just the a string and then just the c string okay it goes like this Okay, so we are playing this and then we grab the F chord and then releasing it. But on the F I'm keeping the ring finger right here on the third fret of the A string, so. And we start the chorus here. F to C basically. Whatever this world can give to me, ooh, you're all I see. Ooh, you make me live now, honey. Ooh, you make me live. And here we start the verse A. We have two different types of verses. This is verse A. It goes like this C to G to A minor to D to F to G and we repeat the same thing one more time I've been with you such a long time you're the first time and I want you to know that my and here we go to E which you can grab just with one finger like that and mute the A string okay and then to a minor to G to F to F minor and here we enter the interlude. Notice that this line has just seven chords instead of eight. So this is the weird measuring that I was talking about earlier. All right, so let's go slowly through the verse A. You're my best friend that I've ever had. Such a long time, you're the sunshine, and I want you to know that my feelings are true. I really love you. F minor, you're my best friend. And on the interlude, again we do this. One thing that I want to point out here is that on this verse A, we have a few chords that starts on the off beat on the previous bar. So we go. One and two and 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 so basically after the G all the chords are starting on the off beat of the previous bar. Two one and two and 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 all right. I hope this makes sense. It's a little bit tricky. It's more like a feeling. Don't try to overthink this. Just try to feel it. When you feel it, it will just become automatic. And the interlude A that we have is basically just C and then F 
you make me leap. And then we start the second verse, verse B. It goes like this, C to G to A minor to C7 and then to F to F minor and then G to E to A minor to D7 and here we have G6 to G and then we finish it on C again on the next interlude but let's see how this goes we'll connect it together with the previous interlude Ooh, you make me leave and I've been wandering around still come back to you Rain or shine, you stood by me, girl. I'm happy at home. You're my best friend. All right, and here we have the interlude B, which is basically the same thing, just the C though, without the F. And after that, we have another chorus, then we have another verse A, and then we have another interlude A. And after that, we have a solo, which is basically on the same chords as verse B and after the solo we go to the outro which uh, again starts with the C you're my best friend but here we have the F minor you're my best friend you're my best and then F major this time again F major to C and here we have G to C really quickly. And we finish it like this. Well, that's a lot to memorize, but it's a nice song, so I guess it's worth it. Give it a try and let me know if it worked out. That's the end of this video. Thank you so much for watching it. Make sure you hit the like button, subscribe to the channel, and you'll see me on my next video. Goodbye.